Greetings, everyone, and welcome back to Victoria 2. I'm your host, Mr. Mocha Lover, and we are Sokoto. Last time, we found quite a bit of access to the sea. We took out quite a few enemies, and we've got a little bit of infamy. This is not where we left off, but it's pretty close to where we left off from yesterday. I went ahead and justified on Dahomey, and we have pretty much have our armies ready to go. We're making a little bit of bank right now. Hopefully, it stays that way so that we can take out Dahomey and take out Ashanti as well, but let's see if we can have a good time now. Before we get too far... These guys have a level 2 score, while Ashanti over here has level 6. I think we'll probably do okay. I hope so. And, yeah. Let's see, we're still trying to use our national focus for bureaucrats. A couple comments to get through from yesterday. Messina. Ooh, we could use Messina. You know what? Hmm. I'm, oh, I don't want to lower my relations with them now, but I kind of have to. Because I don't want them to, or have us together, tag team Mossi. Because if Messina gets Mossi and annexes them, then, wait, no, not that them. Actually, it's Segu. Ooh, Segu. Ooh, yeah, we need get Segu. Because if Messina takes Segu, then they can form the particular empire, and we don't want that to happen. Regardless. Hope you're having a good day. I'm, I'm doing okay myself. Hope we'll do pretty well against these guys. Ashanti shouldn't be too bad. Hopefully, we get some more diplomatic points so we can increase relations with the Brits, because, well, with the Brits, they kind of like us a little bit more. Can we get an alliance? No, that's okay. Hopefully, they sphere us, just because they're fighting the Ottoman Empire. No, Egypt. Oh, they're fighting Egypt. Okay, well, whatever. That's fine. Um... Yeah. Yeah, definitely. That's Well, I guess we don't really have to take out Ashanti. It doesn't really matter too much. Regardless, I asked you guys yesterday wh which reforms we should do, and someone recommended that we should go, actually, with foreign universities, because that helps us with our educational efficiency. We get civilization progress. We get more plurality, which is good. And then we activate technology, enlightenment, philosophy. And that one is right here. And it gives you plus 50% of research points. Actually, that's really, really good. But I did look at the cost for that. And that's like 24, 25,000 points compared to the warfare focused um, points uh, for all the other nations or for all the other reforms, really. So I don't know. We'll see what happens. And at this point, they might give us a peace deal to peace out. Maybe not. I'm going to wait till the beginning of the month to see what happens. Because if I can peace out. We want to do it as fast as possible, pretty much. It costs us points, and we shall extend slavery. Yay! Because right now, I'm going to cut the budget. We need to cut the budget. We have to. Because it's costing us too much, and we got to just pump this up as high as possible, and pump this up a little higher as well. There we go. That should be okay. Hey, white piece, not bad. Cool. And we can afford an okay army, actually. Let's see. Keep building 2-2. Two, two. Boom, boom. Make as many armies as we possibly can. These are not really ideal armies, but I don't really care. Actually, can we make some ships? Ooh. Oh, well, maybe not. We have up to six. Because it's always fun to take out a certain nation, like Uruguay, because they don't have enough pops to do anything there. But we can't do anything about that right now. And I do want to spend some time cutting down our infamy. Infamy is not very good for us. And I would like to go to war with other people. Mostly would be not very bad. There was a recommended... It was recommended for me to go to war with these guys as well. They're allied with Messina, which is not good. And Aro, which is not good as well. Calabar is pretty... Pretty alone. Oh, we have a truce with them too, so we can't really do too much with them. If that's the case, spend more money here because I want to make sure that we get more administration done. That'd be actually really good. Since we've got a little bit of dip diplomatic points now, increase the relations. Hopefully, they can sphere us. For the love of God, I hope they can sphere us. Oh, more divisions. Nice. Good, 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 good. Our money's looking pretty good. Our military score is not too bad either. Actually, I'm really liking our military score right now. Make another one. Yeah, that's going to cost us more. But that's fine. Whatever. Whatever. Lower that even further. Ooh, I could lower this, but I'm going to actually raise this. Raise it a little higher. It's just a tad bit higher. The tariffs are kind of high. I know they are. But we really got that. Got to get that administration efficiency up as high as possible. But it was recommended we take out this D nation. Just because they actually have a lot of culture there. That we could use for ourselves. So, And we can use their pops as well. So that wouldn't be too bad to conquer them. That would be kind of nice, actually. Well, at least we have three armies. Not too bad. Not too great, but not too bad. And, oh, hello, Spain. So, already within five minutes, we took out another nation, which is great. I really want to kill these guys off, though. I really want Messina to die. They're level four. We're level 11. <sighs> Man, you know what? Honestly, we could probably fight them and take Niami, because they need... That's one of the provinces that we need from them to be able to prevent them from forming the Tukular Empire. Because that's probably what we're going to have to do. Segu, Bandiagara, and Niami. 
Yeah, I'm probably going to have to do that. Literacy above 4%. The rights of man. Yeah, that's probably what we're going to have to do. If that's the case, we're going to do this. Come over here. You guys get over here. This 24 stack will focus on that army. And whatever comes this way, we'll just try to beat the snot out of as best we possibly can. Uh, you guys can go there too. That's fine. So Koto is the capital. That's fine. Keep making ourselves better. Keep educating the people. That is super, super, super important. Less than 2% of our population can read, which is not ideal. Okay, now we went down to 1.7, 1.6. It was 1.7, but now it's 1.6. Come on, keep slashing that infamy. And I don't like, and I know people don't like it when I save scum, but sometimes it's just, it's just necessary to save, save scum. All right, so that's kind of hurting us a little bit more right now. Man, administrative stuff is expensive. Let's build up a little bit more of a cash reserve so that we have some extra, extra. What is? I can't even think in my head right now. Extra stockpile. Just in case we fall into that. Our industry is not too bad. We're ninth in the world for prestige. I mean, that's not bad. A West African nation like this? Not bad. No one wants to immigrate here? What is wrong with everyone? What is wrong with everyone? We are one of the best nations in the world. Our prestige doesn't lie, does it? No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. No, no, no. And I just want... Hey, 19 out of 19. Even though some of these guys are probably not really worth building up. And that's okay. We'll give us just a little more time. Our educational policies, we just got to keep spending money on. Spend, 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 spend. Educate, 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 educate. It doesn't help to conquer other people by doing that, but whatever. No, so politics-wise, reforms. We're not looking too bad. We're out of the usual suspects. Clinical real investigation. Ooh, so we might get more plurality. Plurality gives you monthly change. As a shared level of consciousness in a country, the memories of the past victories and defeats in the name of our liberty remind our people of what could be. Plurality, yeah. Revanchism, plurality. Yeah, let's, uh, let's conduct a real investigation. Let's try it. Why not? And this keeps going up because we have westernization, so we will have to beat down some rebels. Now, you know what? We could attack right now, but I'm going to wait because I want to get at least one of these reforms first. Right over here. Under, yeah. So we can do imported weapons. We're probably going to go with... What is this? Does this miss anything? Well, it pisses people off. Advanced constructions, because I would love to do this one, and it's really, really good. But we'll get to that faster if we can get plus 25% research points bonus when conquering. So that's actually not too bad. That's what I'm trying to go for right now. So that would be bad. This one isn't bad. Leadership modifier plus 10%. Well, that's not bad. That would be good to get more leadership. Even though I don't fully, I don't believe I fully understand it 100%. That doesn't matter, though. Because we still need it. So, And we do that. We get post-Nelsonian thought. Imported ships. That's not bad. You actually get two more technologies. That's pretty good. Research points, points when conquering. That costs 10,000. That's a bit too much, in my opinion. Even though get better tariff efficiency, which is pretty good as well. Naval schools is not bad, either. But I'm really thinking imported weapons is okay. We'll probably go with foreign training methods. It's 77,000, 7,700 points. And this one's it's just, it's so easy to get. And once we get that one, then we'll probably go to war. So that when we conquer this territory, or this territory, we can actually use it to the best of its benefit. And, oh, what's going on over here? Why are you, why are you hurting? That's not good. Zadia, come down here. And we're almost done with that. That's good. We're making some serious money. Great, great. Actually, I'm going to cut down the taxes on you guys a little bit then. That's okay. A little bit of red is not bad. Good, 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 good. We probably could use... Wow. We are... We have so many soldiers we can make. I love it. It's great. Now, other West African nations could probably do the same, and let's not forget to do this, too. Please fear us. Please, please, please fear us. Going to cast us money, but that's fine. Hey, our the average literacy of our population is 1.8%. Not bad, if I do say so myself. Hey, look at that. Not bad. Ooh, what, what's going on here? Why is supply limit so bad down here? Oh, is it... Oh, it's a semi... Oh, duh, it's a semi-desert. Mr. Mocha Lover, what are you thinking? Come down here. That'd be fine. Bida. Or Bida. Yo, that's going to really hurt ourselves when we're trying to put our armies over here. And also, I'm kind of waiting for these guys to go to war with someone else as well. Just so that we can have a good time to smash them when they're getting destroyed as well. So, nice. All roads lead to Sokoto. Use Floba. Use Ebo. RGO. Eh, they're pissed off anyways. Let them try to rise up in rebellion and see what happens. Well, actually, don't. Maybe we shouldn't try that. There's a good chance people might revolt. There's only three patriots, though. That's a lot of rebel support, though. Wow, half a million people? That's a lot, not gonna lie. That's quite a bit. 
wool. Hmm. I'm going to go ahead and increase it just a little bit more. All right, let's take a look. That's not too bad. That's getting better and better. Looking pretty good right here right now. And a pretty good army, I'd say. 1.9%. How close are we now? Are we at about 5,000? A little bit less than 5,000, which is not ideal, but whatever. Come on, you're almost done. And then we got to get some clerks, get some clergymen. I think, is that what it is? Yeah, intellect. Oh, intellect. It's, H it's HPM. For, I forgot, yeah. It's HPM. Good, 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 good. Keep making babies, guys. You're doing a great job. Actually, that's the case. I'm going to swap you. Uh, whoops, I hope I'll delay you. Y'all can stay here, and y'all go there. 6-4, eh, that's okay. I think that'll be alright for now. And then do one, two. Because we actually, that wouldn't be bad. Make another one then. Nice. Very good. And this helps lower our infamy as well. So, Persia expands, White Raja. Oh. Queers of Imperial Japan, a Bach concert. Oh, that's cool. 20,000, not bad. Still, ninth in the world. 21st in the world, too. That's not too bad. Good, 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 good. Raise our level of happiness with these guys. They're allied to the Prussians, huh? 12. That's not bad. Look at that. 2%. 2%. Keep going, guys. We're doing a great job. Over 5,000 points now. That's not too bad. Obviously, it's nowhere near what we really want. So, just once we conquer this territory, we should technically get more points. I'm not sure if it, that'll actually happen. Will we get more points if we actually just conquer a piece of territory? Because this says... Research points when conquering. So it doesn't mean annex, it just means conquering. So, we'll see what happens. And I'm kind of waiting for some sort of uh, rebellion to happen, actually, too. Yeah, they don't like what we're doing. Just, just, you know, just accept what we're doing. So, oh, wow, that's a lot. That's actually not that bad. They have 4, 000, 4, de, 4 brigades, I guess. Number of brig possible brigades, 251. Holy crap. Number of brigades ready to join General Rising, 4. That's three quarters of a million people. That's that's a lot of dudes, not gonna lie. That's a lot of dudes. It is already 1844 though, so that's not too bad. Come on, guys. Go to someone go to work with someone else. They have only level four score. I mean we could probably beat them up pretty easily, actually. Masina and Otto. Uh, we could actually beat those guys up pretty pretty not too difficult with too much difficulty probably either. Let's get some more cavalry now. There you go. We've got a nice stockpile right going right now though. That's good. Going right even higher. Foreign trading posts? Despite the obvious rightness of our country's trade policies, greater amounts of foreign goods could be useful, and elements within our administration suggested setting up a limited trade post in one of our coastal cities, where foreign ships can moor and trade without compromising the cultural integrity of Sokoto. It could be an economic boom to the area and the nation, but conservative voices warn that destructive foreign influences might further creep into our society. Keep it small and simple, keep it under control. Ooh, life needs goes down. More hot militancy? Hmm, no. Keep it small, keep it simple. That's gonna be pissing off a lot of people here. I kind of hope we do get, we do have a lot of infamy, but whatever. I do hope that we do get rebellions before we actually go to war. That would be actually pretty good. So that we, this way we can deal with it now instead of later. i got to keep an eye on that too, because we'll spread, spread some cavalry over there too. And that'll be great. 2.2% of our population can read. Go figure. Can maybe lower the taxes just a smidgen for the, the middle class. Just a little bit. But I'm going to raise them back up all the way to max once we uh, go to war. That'll be good. Don't forget about these guys. Increase relations. We've got to be getting close, right? We've got to be getting close. We're at less than 6,000 still. Gosh darn it. Oh, it takes so long to do this. I'm mean, unifying this area. Western Africa is not that difficult, obviously. Just got to get a little lucky. So, And even the... Oh, they have one prestige. Oh, they actually have a prestige. They're even worse than West Africa. How could Uruguay be... Well, I guess... If they have less than 9,000 people in their population, that does influence the region. Actually, you guys are done. That's good. So you guys are done, too. Ooh, do we have cores on all this territory? We do not. Is there any place... Yeah, these guys should get the bureaucrats next, then. More efficiency around here. More and more efficiency. That would be good. 100%. Nice. It looks like we're maxed out on RG... Almost... Well, actually, we got way too many RGOs or employees here working the RGOs, actually. Semi-desert RGO size. Province size, 7%. Or 7 times, actually. Cool. Oh, look at that. Bombarda wants an alliance, huh? Wolof, Mossi, Gabu. Yeah, I don't really want to ally anyone down here. I'd rather have a European ally, not going to lie. But I doubt we'll get one. I really kind of doubt it. Hey, yes. Good. Wow. We have roughly nine <laughs> consciousness in our country. That's not good. Mm. But, you know what? Go figure. 
Actually, who's in your sphere? Crucial states. I'm not seeing us yet. Cooch. I don't see. Oh, wait, hold on. Is that, is that our flag? No, that's a Mughal Empire. Would someone like to sphere us, please? Please? Anybody? Anybody, please. Oh, oh, well, it's a little late. I already merged them together. Whatever. Whatever. Alright, 2.4%. It's 45 already. Come on. Just get. Okay, so we're getting close. Watara. I think we saw them yesterday, too, right? Is that Watara? No, what, where's Watara? Is that Watara? Oh, Watara's right there. They're not allied with anybody. They're a primitive nation. Oh, you guys actually have an ally, huh? Nah, we good. Ashanti doesn't obviously like us. You guys are allied with the D word up there. That wouldn't be bad trying to go kill off right now, though. Yeah, we could probably actually do that. Yeah, let's go and try that. I'm tired of waiting. Come on, don't get found out. Don't get found out. Come on, come on, come on. You got three months left. Ooh, at the halfway point, I will go ahead and begin to raise up our conscription level or army level and start moving our soldiers. Come on, come on, come on. And we're pretty much at the halfway level, so I'm not too worried about it anymore. Cool. All right, cost goes up, cost goes up. So be it. Raise the taxes, raise the taxes a little higher. It's just a war machine. What do you expect? And can you support level 40? Yes, you can. And you guys come down here too. You guys can support it, right? Oh, 52. That's so good. 7.4 infamy, so be it. Whatever. Basically cutting that down. Cutting it, cutting, 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 cutting. Nice. Mission R. I mean, we could wait to get the benefit here too, but I just want to go at least get one more war. One more war. Let's give it one more month. Boom, so we can get that lower infamy, and here we go. Oh, yeah, they're also allied with these guys, but eh, I'm not too worried about it. Actually, going to war with these guys is probably not bad, but Toyd, Ebo, well, maybe they don't really have that many core cultures similar to us, but that's fine, whatever. Let's go and take them out. Overwhelming numbers. Beautiful. Patriotic Society. Oh, shut it down. Eh, do that. Hey, over 9 militancy? No, that's not probably good. But whatever. Alright, we just killed off 3,000 of them immediately. Not bad. And take them out as fast as we can. Ignore them. Europeans harassed. The high militancy among certain parts of the population in Lagos has led to an outbreak of violence directed to local expatriate foreigners. The embassies of the great powers have all lodged formal diplomatic complaints with our government and seem to expect some sort of action on our part, which we do. Ignore them. Round up the usual suspects. Yeah. I'm going to round up the usual suspects because we don't want to piss off those um, other dudes, we'll say. Wait, what? Uh, oopsie. Yeah, I don't want to suffer from too much attrition. You guys actually leave. Come to Sokoto, which is a derrit. Derrit? Desert. 66% is not bad. Very good. Conquer these guys quickly. Get out of war. Have a good time. What are you leaving for, son? You should be able to win Abduli. Abdullahi. Abdullahi. Uh, yes, thank you. Thank you very much. We love slavery. Alright, cut these guys down immediately. Good. Lower that a little more. There we go. Alright, so I'm going to put you on that type of thing for now. I'm going to put you guys right there so we can make maybe a little bigger army. There you go. Three more. Not bad. Three more would be okay. You get uh, three times... Three plus four is usually seven. So yeah, actually having three more cavalry is probably a little bit too much, but whatever. Wow, we're making some serious money now. Look at that. Nice. That's actually pretty good. If that's the case, let's ruin it. Thank you. If that's the case, I'm going to keep the military here because we might have revolts eventually. So you know, let me lower that by a little bit more. 72%. We should have a reform pretty darn soon. Yeah, pretty darn soon. And then we'll go to war with... Not these guys since we just went to war with them. We'll go to war with whoever we can find. Yeah, Messina's probably the guys we gotta go to war with. Yeah, we gotta get Niami. Even though there's not that many people here, it just, as a safe measure, we gotta take it out, so. In the meantime, hey, UK, how you doing? Actually, let's see, sphere button. We have not been spe sphered yet, which kind of sucks. Actually, here's Spain. Now, historically, you went, you came back after what happened in, what, the 16th century with the Spanish Netherlands? That's quite interesting, but okay, well. Alright, whatever. 20, 20. Uh, come over here. Nikki. Nikki? Nikki. Look at that money. Lower that. Lower that too. 
Nice. Full spending on education now. <gasps> oh, we got it. We got it. Let's get the first one. And now we got to start doing stuff here. Nice. Training methods. Awesome, 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 awesome. And this is the part of the campaign where I might have to start saves coming. So I apologize ahead of time because, well, it's just something that we've got to do to keep going. And I know people don't like it, but it is what it is. Humiliate, choir state. We can free people, actually. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Oh, and I guess I'll see you in just a little bit. All right, everyone, my apologies about that, and I, like I said before, I know a lot of people do not like it when I save scum, but I, we can't really afford to do really well without save scumming, just a little bit, just because we want to, you know, get through West Africa as fast as we can, right? Right? But anyways, as you saw, we just got a war justification, we got to raise up the budget for the army now, and we might need to raise a couple more taxes. Honestly, off screen, nothing really happened except me just waiting here, building up maybe an army bigger, maybe, maybe that's it. So, really didn't miss too much, uh, let's check over here. This is getting 90%, 90-ish percent done, so that's pretty good. Over here, uh, I might recommend you guys move somewhere else, maybe. 40%, yeah, over here really sucks. Why does it have to be a desert? Actually, you guys can move over here, and you guys can move over here. There you go. I'm going to go to war pretty soon. We'll see what happens. And actually, uh, there you go. Build another army, because we can. Cool, and we'll go to war very, 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 very soon. Zakuka. Actually, you know what? We'd probably go to war right now. Everybody first, not bad. Got less infamy now. Let's go ahead and grab this territory. And which territory is it properly? Messinian Outer Hauseland. Actually, who owns the Hauseland? Ah, oh, both these guys own Hauseland. Let's, let's go to regional stuff. Ah. Oh. You're all Hau Outer Hauseland. Oh, you guys should have killed each other off earlier. Eh, it doesn't matter. As long as we take it away from these guys, that's what matters. Thank you. Could have got a war. Could have gone to war over ten buck too, but whatever. Oh, they don't want to join the fight. Come on, man. Come on. Well, if they don't, I'm gonna leave you guys down here, and you can be a garrison army just in case, because these guys still have only four score, so that's not too bad. Yeah, we're only fighting these guys. Yeah, they're probably intimidated. I mean, <laughs> military power is twenty-four, so I can kind of see why they didn't join the war, which kind of sucks. That means we have to go fight them in a separate war later on, but whatever. Foul murder. Sokoto's in a state of collective shock. His news broke today of a foul murder committed in one of our states. The young girl working as a prostitute in the state was found brutally battered by a client. And rumor has it that the police are covering up the identity of the murderer, who has been claimed, belongs to a rich banking family of some local renown. Police, however, maintain that they are still investigating the matter, but no perpetrator has yet been located. The appearance is on everyone's lips, and the debate has even reached Parliament, where the Liberal MPs demand answers for the, from the government regarding the matter. How old was... You say young girl. How old was she working as a prostitute? I got questions for you, man. Then again, I guess it's a rich upper class person doing stuff, but okay. Demand that the, the police produce a perpetrator. Uh, yeah. Yeah, let's, let's, let's see what happens from that. Um, define young. <laughs> like, 20s? Or teens? Or... Hmm. Watch out, the Ottoman Empire's at war with Nijed now. Now, once these guys are gone... That'd be good. Now, once we have this, that'll solidify our ability to do whatever we need to. Uh, if you find these guys, you can probably just get rid of them, right? Why do they, why do they, what's even around here? It's just a desert. Why are you just hanging out in Tessalit? Okay. Oh, Sokoto, yeah, why not? Cool. Um, great. I'm not really sure what to say. Jugu? Cool, come down there. You guys come down there just in case. You help garrison areas. Build up another army, I guess. Because we can really just basically push people to accept our will for whatever we want. Oh, it's still stuck for 20 around here, though. That's not bad, though. We love slavery. 2.5% literacy. Still not bad. Ooh, do we lower our administrative, administrative stuff? That would be bad to do, yeah. So a little bit more. Middle class, you can be taxed a little bit more. There you go. Really not too bad. And I don't want to forget about this. Oh, you're not done yet, though. That's cool. Very, very good. Ooh, what is happening over here? We won the occupation. Gal is over. But I'm so glad we got this. That is so good. Ooh, actually, you guys get in here. That's fine. Yeah. Ten... Ah, it's not 10%. That's better than some of the other areas that we actually have. And I... Oh, I should have seen how many research points we got from that. So we do need to go to war with someone else next. Calabar. Obviously, they don't have a lot of research points, but... Ooh, we could try it again. Mm. Even though going mm, 22, 
I'll do the same thing again. I apologize. Like, it's just it's something we got to do if we want to be successful in this campaign. I call it a necessary evil. 14%, not bad. I love it. Basically, 100% faster for justif justifying other people. Love it. Oh, well, pretty much already a third done. There was a war between some people. Doesn't matter to me. 15.73, great. And mission. Oh, God, no. That's going to slow us way down then. Eh, we still 50 days. That's not too bad. Oh, should have paused the game a little sooner. That's alright. We're making a lot of money. And we got 53,000 in the bank. Not bad. Just a few more taxes, that's all. And I even lowered tariffs, too. We're still green. Love it. You guys looking great. Alright. Bureaucrats, 0%. 0.38. That's not bad. 5%. You guys could probably use bureaucrats, too, so. And that should actually increase you guys up by quite a bit more. Yep, it's going up already. Nice. Now, it's an encore province to say, but we got the Jizya, which is some sort of, I think, Muslim, Islamic type of tax, I believe, if I remember correctly. Calabar, I am so sorry what I'm about to do to you. But not really, because you belong under us. Especially if you have no allies. Uh, I love being West African. I don't think anyone or that many people have ever said that really. Especially in the 19th century. Uh, and we're a slave nation. Oh my goodness, what more could you ask for? Alright, and I'm going to have one guy just follow and Buya? Buya? Thank you very much. We appreciate your dedication to your country. Well, you're dead now, but whatever. Alright, let's grab one more thing of cavalry if we can. I'm going to cut you down a little bit more so we can actually have good division for that. And I know this does hurt our actually... Oh, actually, you know what? They might just give it to us. They might just actually piece us out. Ooh, we did wait a month. We'll, we'll wait just a little bit longer. We can always go ahead and cut these guys down. Thank you. And thank you. There you go. See? It's good to wait a little bit. Nice. And our piece. This is looking pretty good. Look at Skoto. Looking pretty gosh darn awesome. The intellectuals. Control the intellectuals. Get rid of the worst troublemakers. Control the intellectuals. That's probably the best thing to do. Hey, already 11%. Not bad. Because once we get all these areas up to bureaucrats to 100% in all our states, which might actually take a while. Oh, I should have looked at the points, the educational points thing. Um, yeah. Spain? They're below those guys. What was I saying? Politics. Ooh. Yeah, we just gotta conquer, 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 conquer at this point. Because this is not going fast enough. Ooh, how about Kufa? People won't care if I go to war with Kufa, right? Conquest. Mm hmm. That's not bad. You guys come over here. They only have 3,000 soldiers. I'm not too worried about that, so... I'm much more worried about being found out. I don't understand why it costs us so much infamy. I guess it's, you know... I know why infamy exists. So that people just can't be, can't be just killing each other all the time, and again, and again, and again. Which I'll see you in just a little bit. But still, like, we're West Africa, why not? But regardless, I'll be back in just a little bit. Alright, everyone, so, I apologize once again, but... I was eventually found out, and our infamy went up by point... One of all things, point one. But let's go and do this as well, and do this. Cool. And also, these guys are killing each other. Mossi and Massina are killing each other. So I'd say pretty interesting, pretty cool. We did raise our, uh, our budget up, but honestly, like like normal, just nothing really happened off screen. We just want to conquer as much as we can, so we can make sure that we can do pretty darn well for ourselves. All right, so you guys come over here. Actually, not really too worried about that at all. And how's this coming along? 12%, that's not bad, actually. 12.1. And they're gone. Cool. Thank you very much. Actually, it is a first. You can probably lower this already. Make more money. Come to Nguru? No. Come down here in Kuka. That'd be good. We'll wait until like July 31st to see if they actually give me... There they go. There they go. Beautiful. Hey, actually, that helps out, too. Nice. Oh, that actually did lower the administration by quite a bit, though. Ooh, hmm. Ah, I keep forgetting to check this. I mean, obviously, we're not going to get that much research points from doing that. But every little bit does help. And which means I'm probably going to go with this one next. It costs basically 10000 But if you can conquer more and more and more, faster, 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 that'd be good. Oh, wait, what happened? Oh, oh, look at that. Messina's now a rump state up here with Timbuktu. 
And these guys got Bandiagara, so they might want to come attack us for this. Now, if we go to war, these guys, they have a score of 11. These guys have a score of 8. We have a score of 28. These guys have a score of 2. I'm not really worried about those guys. So, that's interesting, huh? 20. 40. If we could take these guys out and actually annex these guys, that would probably be the best thing for us to do. Come on. And we're going to need actually everyone for this then. Jugu, come down over there. I'm going to beat uh, Do you actually have... You need one more. You need another cavalry. There you go. Nice, nice, nice. 7.8%, good. A lot of different cultures here. That's totally fine with me. 9.11 consciousness. Not bad, not bad. Just keep making more money. Tax the heck out of the poor people too. Actually, we have no, go no gold, huh? No precious metals. Nothing like that, huh? Well, I guess my thumbnail kind of lied. I thought there was gold around here, but maybe we'll find it later on. Because I'm pretty sure when I looked up, Nigeria has some gold. So, got about a month left. Going to boost up the budget. Tax people. Just, 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 just a tiny bit more. The middle class can afford that. I'm sure they can, right? And rebuilding the divisions, hopefully. Because we have four, basically, pretty much four full armies. I mean, that's pretty good. Okay, we weren't found that time. Great. Ooh, how much morale do we actually have? Or organization? Let's give it one more month, and then we'll go to war. We'll be good after this next month. Alright, here we go. Now let's go to war. Because if we wait too long, their score is just going to keep going up. 10 and 11. Ours are still 28, so combined, we're still all ahead of them. Conquest. Wagadugu, Dori, Fada, Ungorma. Ungorma. And we're fighting these guys too, which really sucks, but whatever. It is what it is. Uh, you guys probably got to get up there too. Oh! Hey, look at this guy. Amadu Ibrahim versus Pintyeba Moru. Nice. Oh, that, that seals the deal there. Oh, yeah, please. Hope we don't get rebels. We are literally eighth in the world in prestige. That is so awesome. Let's go right there. You guys. Actually, I'm going to send you guys back. Probably to deal with those guys, maybe. See what happens. Because we got. We, if we have three armies here, that's still pretty good, so. A lot of attrition, which is not good, though. Oof. 2.9%, not bad. Hey, good job, guys. Good job. Actually, just going to see ya. Because we can move you guys to Wahi Gaia. Wahi Gaia. Wahi Gaia? I don't know, Wahi Gaia. So all, we probably won't be able to conquer the D word nation here. We we'll probably still do okay. Actually, go right there. There you go. That's nice. Oh, anarcho lib. Oh boy, anarcho lib was over there. What the heck? Dori. Oh, oh boy. No. Please. Thank you. Wait, why did you both go there? Actually, Bandiagara. What do What do they have over there? It is a semi-desert, so it doesn't really hurt too badly, then. Hey, nice. As long as we got one army trying to conquer all these guys, that's what, that's what really matters. You guys should be able to attack them under Abadu Ibrahim. There you go. And once these guys get in there, they're done. Yeah, even they, even if the, they might have a bigger army, it doesn't even matter. It really doesn't even matter. Just stay here and take them out. Oh, they died. Oh, look at that. Hey, the Radical Faction. Not bad. Still making more money. I love the military industrial complex. 3% research or literacy. Not bad at all. Hey, kill them off. Thank you. Great job, guys. Yeah. West Africa, not too bad. I would, well, maybe so far recommend it until the Europeans arrive. Uh, yeah, once the Europeans show up, uh, we'll see what happens. I mean, we don't have to kill these guys off, but we might try to do so. Come on, you can get in there before they... Oh, you couldn't get in there. Gosh darn it. It's alright. We almost have this group too. Right. Come on back. You guys should be able to win here, right? Balobo Saeed Hull. Less organization, but whatever. Oh, they're almost dead. There we go. Oh, wait. What do you guys want? Yeah, that's fine. 
Nice. Once this is gone, we want to peace out pretty much immediately. You guys come back home. Hang out here because you're going to need another army. Yeah, you guys are going to be looking severely weak. You guys come to Nikki or Nikki. Nice. Got to wait till the 30th. Come on, someone give me a good deal. Nope, fine, we'll spend our own points. Oh, so before we do that, I almost forgot again. Six, basically, basically 6,100. So if we annex this pretty large nation of Mossi, what do we get? It's almost just under 6,100 points. Win the battle. Of course, we're extend slavery. Everyone loves slavery where we're at. Oh, wow, we got about 5,000, literally 5,000 more points. Now, that was worth it. That was really worth it. Now, I would love to do all this other stuff, especially the foreign universities, but it just, it's just too expensive right now. But, if we keep taking out more people with the whole research points bonus and conquering, I think that work, would work very well for us. We could do naval schools as well. Research points and conquering as well. Naval experience gain. Don't get too much naval foreign officers. Can we build ships? I want to get a Uruguay before they can do anything. Post Nelsonian thought. What is that one? Post Nelsonian thought. It allows a naval base. Uh, I mean, we could. I mean, even if they build an army up down there, it probably won't be too bad. So, yeah. I just want to take him out, because why not? Because he always can. But, in the meantime, imported artillery, advanced construction. I like that one. Imported weapons. You get flint lock rifles. That could be pretty darn good to use. And flint lock rifles, actually. Well, they allow you to use infantry, which is pretty good. Much better than irregulars. I don't really like irregulars at all, but it's what we got. So we'll probably choose naval schools eventually. But we're going to grab foreign officer training just because that research point bonus is so good. So, so good. But I think that's where we're going to conclude today's episode. We've done really, really well. I know people don't like it when I say it's coming, like I said before. But it is what it is. But regardless, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. We are the seventh in the world for prestige. And I will see you tomorrow when we shall continue conquering more of Western Africa. And hopefully westernizing within the next few episodes. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.